Hi everyone! Today we're going to show you how to create price rules for your bookable products or services with our plugin Yid Booking and Appointment for WooCommerce. With these rules you can change the base price or the fixed base fee based on specific dates, range of months, how many people are involved in the booking, and more. Before we get into it, please remember to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit that bell down below so that you know every time we have a new video for you. Now, let's get to it! Once you activate the plugin and go over to Yid, Booking and Appointment, Configuration, you'll find this Price Rules section where you can create global price rules to apply to all your bookable products. On each bookable product edit page, you can create price rules at a product level. Both sections have the same options. But here, you can create global price rules to increase or decrease the price of all bookable products for specific conditions. Let's click on Create Rule. The conditions you will find are Custom date range Range of months Range of years weeks Range of days People count Duration unit Time range And people Keep in mind you will be able to use the people options only if the people module is enabled and here below people you should find all the people types you created. In my case I created these ones, over 60, student, children and adult. First we're going to create a group discount, so we're going to name the rule and we're going to select the people count option. We're going to give a 20% discount to groups of people that have 4 people or more. So we're going to enter 4 here, I'm not going to enter anything here. You can enter 7, so the discount is applied if there are 4 to 7 people added to the booking. But I'm not going to set that limit, I'm just going to offer that discount for any number of people from 4 on. And what I'm going to do is activate this one. Rule changes the base price because that's what I'm going to change, the base price of the product. And right here you're going to find all the options to change that base price. You can increase the price, decrease it, multiply the price, divide it, or set a fixed price. I'm going to select this one right here, decrease the price as a percentage by 20%. You can also use this rule to change the fixed base fee, but I'm just going to use it to change the base price. I'm going to click on Add Rule, Save Rule. Now let's go over to the side. Okay, so I have this bookable product. The price is $20 a day. I configure this so the base price is always multiplied by the number of people included in this booking. So let's select a day, just one day, and we're going to add just one person. So you see here that it's $20 a day. There you go. So we're going to add another person. So for two people, it's 40. We're going to add 3 people, 60, and if we add 4 people, it's going to be 64 because that 20% discount is applied to those $80 that should be charged for a 4 people group. And if I keep adding people, I'm going to keep getting that discount. Let's go back, and now I'm going to create another discount for students using the people types that I have added here. So I'm going to create a price rule for students and I'm going to select the student people type here and this is going to be a discount for any student that is added to the booking. So from one on, we're going to be given this discount. So I'm not going to set anything here. I'm going to click here to change the base price and I'm going to select decrease the base price by. So in this case, I'm going to decrease the base price by $10 for every student added to the booking. Add rule, save rule, back to the site, refresh. Okay, same thing here, we're going to just choose one day. If I select one adult, it's $20, two, $40, three, $60. But what if I do one adult? and one student. It's going to be $30 because that one student has the $10 discount. If I add two students, it's going to be 40 because it's two students with a $10 discount. If I add three students, 
for a total of four people, it's going to be the 20% group discount plus the $10 discount for each of those three students included in the booking. And that's it. That's how easy it is to create price rules with our plugin. Try creating your own price rules now. Okay, so that's how you can create price rules. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up and we'll meet again for our next video.